The NGG13 Garrett locomotive with a mixed train stops at Via Lima for a water stop. The engine gets the water tank topped up. It is noteworthy that in a crazy world of steam, the locomotives usually get to eat and drink before their pet humans do. However, the locomotives have done all the work, so it's only fair. This train has the task of circling the entire railway network. We will travel on the footplate, admiring the driving and firing skills of the visiting re-steamers driver Chris Simon and those of just past fireman Michael Hill. The driver opens the regulator handle. As soon as the train begins to move, he gently releases the handle for slow, smooth acceleration. In a nutshell, the skill of the fireman is to produce steam effectively, while the skill of the driver is to make the best possible use of that steam. After a while, the hungry furnace in the firebox needs refueling. The fireman places each shovel full in a different area of the firebox. The proper distribution of the coal over the grate assures high efficiency of combustion. The driver uses the reversing lever almost as much as the regulator so that he can control the power output of the locomotive. He maintains a short cutoff with the regulator wide open. He knows that the shorter the cutoff, the more economically the steam is being utilized and therefore the less the consumption of coal and water is required. The train is now thundering down a falling gradient and the driver uses the brakes to control the speed. When the locomotive operates at high speed, the water in the boiler is consumed at a fast rate and frequent water injections are needed to keep the water at the prescribed level. The fire is also consumed rapidly, so the fireman is a rather busy chap. The engine driver is constantly busy. All the time he manipulates the regulator handle and the reversing gear. He also looks at and listens to the engine. He must also watch the line for potential danger and check all the signals on the track and also be checking that the line is clear and safe for the train to pass. Finally, at Hookfontaine, the train has reached its destination.
Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing and ring the bell to be notified when we upload new videos. Thanks for your support.